Hey y'all, what's up? It's Jessica. Welcome back and thank you guys so much for tuning in today. Today's video is all about my mascara routine. I'm going to be sharing with you guys the mascara that I use to get super full, thick, voluminous, falsy looking lashes. I love false lashes. I love what they do for your lash girl. They just instantly give it life. But I'm lazy so I just tend to not even want to deal with lashes. And I want my makeup routine to be a little bit more simplified so I started dibbling and dabbling into some mascaras and playing around with stuff and I found my staples that really just make my lashes pop. People assume that I either have false lashes on or they ask me where do you get your lashes done? Cause they think they're like those individual lashes but no girl it's just mascara it's just mascara so i'm gonna share with you guys my ride or die mascaras the ones that just give me so much life and you don't have to wear false lashes to look done up you don't have to wear falsies to look beat girl and i'm gonna show you how i get beat without false lashes all right so if you like to see how i transform my short thin sparse lashes into some bomb photo ready sexy voluminous long luscious lashes let's dive into the video all right so as you can see i don't really have super full lashes they're actually pretty sparse um they're not thick or anything like that at all i wish i had my daughter's lashes because she has gorgeous lashes but my lashes are actually quite short quite thin and the only thing is that they they're curled so i never really curl my lashes in order for me to get the look that i desire like fuller lashes, longer lashes, thicker lashes. I'm gonna show you guys my ride or die mascaras. These are like my, these are my base. I never apply my mascara without applying these four. And yes, that kind of looks like a lot of product, but they actually all work really well together. In order for me to get that false lash look without using actual false lashes, I go on with these four mascaras. So if you're just like, girl, that's just too many steps for me, by all means do you, but this is just what works for me, girl. So let's get right into it. So the first things first, I go in with my L'Oreal Voluminous Base. This is a lash primer. I saw Makeup Shayla use this um, a few videos ago and I immediately went out and bought it and it's actually really, really good. But before I apply my lash base, I like to tight line my eyes. And what this does is kind of just make your lash line appear thicker and I basically just tight line. I take my finger and I lift up. And I know this looks extremely scary, but it's not. And you just want to line the inner rim of your eyes. Don't poke your eye out when you're doing this, kids. You wanna keep your eyes after this process. And that just makes your lash line appear a little bit more darker and gives the illusion of a fuller, a fuller lash line. After that, I go in with my L'Oreal Voluminous Base Eyelash Primer. This is a white base primer. It looks like a mascara, but the product is white. And this is what you apply on your eye before you apply your mascara and it's a base so it's going to coat your lashes it's going to make your lashes appear thicker it's going to add volume to your lashes before you put on your mascara so i start from the base of my lashes and i wiggle on up so you get in that root and you want to oh that was too much product wiggle up And once you do that, then you can kind of coat the entire lash, the entire lashes. And then I go in with the end and I really go in there and apply the product because the end has most of the product. And just wiggle your wand. You can even blink into it. And that's going to help get the product on your lashes. So already, look at the transformation i look bald here and then all of this lash like where did it come from this stuff is so good you guys if you have not tried the l'oreal voluminous um primer eyelash primer girl get you some of this applying the l'oreal eyelash base and as you can totally see it definitely makes a huge difference if i were to go in just with my mascara on my eye it would not give me this much volume so this is definitely a great start um, before you apply your regular mascara okay so i don't allow that to dry all the way down i want it to be a little bit tacky so that it can hold on to the mascara my next ride or die bay is this one this is by maybelline this is their colossal big shot eyelash mascara girl I love this one this is a drugstore product 
and this is an amazing mascara. So I use this one to thicken my lashes. Each mascara I use serves a specific purpose. That's why I use so many. So I'm, I'm not just crazy. There's a reason behind this madness. I use this to thicken my lashes. I start from the base first. Really coat that base before I move to the tips. And I wiggle the wand back and forth. I love the wand on this one because it's not too thick. Once I have enough product on my actual base, I then move the product up to the actual lashes. And I just, you know, wiggle it in. I blink into it. I actually go under the hairs, so like behind the hairs, and just comb and work the mascara through, just so that you can't see any of the residue from the L'Oreal base primer then I go back into the tube and I go with the tips and this is where I pack on that mascara the end of your mascara wand holds the most product then I just go back in work it through all right so that is after applying the Maybelline Big Shot Colossal Lash Mascara and look girl you can already see the difference between my lashes this one's fuller, more alive, longer. This one's short, kind of bald, she needs some hair. You could totally just stop there. If you're good with this, you could stop there, but I like my lashes to look a little bit more dramatic. So I'm gonna go in with my all-time favorite mascara. This is Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. This literally will take your lashes from zero to 100, no lie. This is a super thick wand. She's super thick, so you have to be careful with this one because you don't want mascara all over your eyelid. So I use the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara for volume. I love super volumized lashes. So the Big Shot Mascara was to thicken my lashes. This one is to add volume to my lashes. So I go in with the tips because again, we are adding volume to the lashes. And I apply it from root to tip. Now this one is extremely, the product is extremely thick and if you don't like clumpy spider lashes, you might not like this product, but I, I do. I love clumpy spider lashes. The thicker, the better for me. And then I just work it in. This product is really, really thick. So you just work it in. All right, so. Look at the difference, you guys. Look at the difference between this eye and this eye. And this eye right here, it's super, it looks like you have on falsies. And as you guys can see, I did not grow my lashes right in front of you. It's just the products that I use and I love this mascara. Literally, look at the difference. It's insane. Okay, so the last and final mascara that I like to use is the Benefit Their Real Mascara. I love, 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 love this mascara. I love it on its own, but I also love it when I do these steps because this one is very fine. It's like finely combed, if you guys can see that. It's super fine. Like the bristles are extremely fine. This one I use to comb through my lashes to comb through it and to separate. So if there's any unnecessary clumping, I use this one to comb through it. So I go behind and just kind of comb and separate. It also lengthens, which is really good. And there's fine bristles at the end of the mascara wand as well. I do like that clumpy look because I, I feel like it makes my lashes look fuller. So I do go back in with the Better Than Sex mascara just to add a little bit more clump to it. And I also repeat the same steps on my bottom lashes as well. So I go in with my lash primer, my L'Oreal lash primer. And I use a mirror to look up so that I don't get anything below my eye. I concentrate really hard when I'm doing my bottom lashes because they're so uh, fine and I don't want to mess up or get mascara on my face. I'm going to go in with my Colossal Big Shot Maybelline Mascara. Then I'm going to go in with Too Faced Better Than Sex very carefully because again, this is a thick wand. It's kind of messy, so I want to be super careful. 
All right, so now I'm gonna go in with the Benefit Mascara to finish this off. Okay, so once I've applied my mascara, my top coat is already dry, so I like to take my finger and just push everything up because the mascara tends to move everything forward. And you want your lashes to be curled up. So that is the end of the video and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what's your favorite mascara. What do you use for your lashes? What's your ride or die mascara? And let me know if you've tried any of these items that I mentioned today or if you are wanting to try them to kind of get fuller, thicker lashes. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't right there in that little red button. Just hit it right there and you can join the family. And you can also check out my latest videos right over here so you can get caught up. Caught up. Caught up. All right, you guys, that's all, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.